Hey everyone, this is Lil Brown from Going Social. I just wanted to do a quick video tutorial to show you how to check your dynamic creatively ad, dynamic creative ads on Facebook and see how those ads are performing. So first of all, what's a dynamic creative ad? So when you're creating an ad, there is one type of ad, instead of having to test um, a whole ad against another ad with, let's say, a different image or a different headline or different text copy, what you can do is create one single ad and set it to have dynamic creative. And while you're creating that ad, you can select different elements. So as an example, in this ad, this is for a pediatric dental office. Um, in this ad, when I set it up, instead of setting up four different ads with four different images, running them within the same ad set and letting the algorithm um, choose which one would perform better, I created one ad and in that ad I added the four different images. I also have um, two different headlines. So generally, I mean, this is even a lot of variations. You don't want to do too many variations because uh, unless you have a large budget, in this case, I have a very small budget that I'm working with. Um, so we're not really giving the algorithm enough time and, and resources to play. But what essentially happens is as the ad is showing, Facebook's algorithm will dynamically choose a different um, image and a different, either you could have different um, landing page URLs, you could have different ad copy text, different headlines, and even different calls to action buttons. And, and the algorithm will choose a variation of those and show it. And over time, you can see how your ad is performing. So let's jump in now um, and I'll show you how you can see those results. So basically, you have to be at either the ad set level or the ad level within uh, Ads Manager to see the results. So again, I only have um, a small budget that I'm working with here. This ad has only been running for a day, actually less than a day right now, um, and we've already got some results. So in order to see the results, you have to go to this Breakdowns tab, and then what you wanna do is, is come under by dynamic creative ad sets, and then you can select any one of these. So I'm choosing image, as mentioned, there was four different images. One of them I am going to stop using, and it's this one because it is just too heavy in text. I, I wanted to, to try a couple variations, but this one has a lot of text, and I already knew that Facebook wasn't going to show that as much, and that's exactly what the results show. Images with text are not given as much reach as images without. Um, so right away I can see that this um, image that is here is the one that so far has generated two lead forms. Now that's this type of ad um, is a lead form gen ad. So the ad itself has a lead form attached to it where we can collect leads from interested um, users. So right away I can see by looking at this which ads are, are getting the most reach and those are these two. The ad frequency is all great, and I can see, um, and, and again, this is too short of a time, it's over a day, but I can see the results. So this helps me identify um, which, now in this case, it's not loading, but here, uh, again, this is the two variations on the, the headline. I can see which one performs better. So why is this important? Well, in this case, I'm doing this ad to test the results, and I can, I can get an understanding of for this audience, in this setup, and in this um, uh, purpose of this ad, I now know, based on letting the algorithm run over a, a period of time, I now know what works, what has been performing best. So when I wanna test this ad again, maybe to a different audience, instead of having to go through the whole process of having dynamic creative again, now I can know the one or two variations that are best and just use those, and it allows me to not have to, to do this testing every time, and I can, I can go with the, the better performing ad and see how that runs. So that's how to see um, how your dynamic creative ad is performing and how the results are doing. Hope this was an informative video for you. Again, my name is Lowell Brown from Going Social, and I hope to see you in the next video.